welcome to Rhonda Said. I'm Rhonda and I'm glad to see you here today. And we are doing a get ready with me and having a new palette at the same time. And the new palette is Orchid Do Not. Get it? Kid Do Not. Orchid Do Not. It's very lovely. Um, please like, comment, subscribe, and ring the bell down below. I would really appreciate it. And if you'd like to see the inside of this palette, it is stunning and it is in one of my very favorite purple colors it's purple it's delightful and lovely <laughs> and maybe you'd like to see some magic swatches all right if you insist bam magic swatches all the way there nine colors for this nine pan palette and that is just one swipe of each color and it is very pigmented and the packaging is very reminiscent of the uh, monochromatic palettes that Colourpop did for the longest time so it's nice plastic packaging I've got it all felt up because <laughs> I've been me messing with it but before we get to that I need to do a little blush a little bronzer and then we can get into the palette. I've already got my foundation. I've got some, if you see that shimmer, that is some Danessa Myricks highlighting, illuminating veil under my foundation in Synergy. I really find that way of doing um, a liquid highlighter underneath my foundation just gives the best subtle glow. Not that I don't like an alien slit you know, moment, but I just really enjoy the subtle glow. And I put it on my cheeks, the tip of my nose, my forehead, the bow of my lip and my chin. <laughs> anyway, so let's do some bronzing. And I'm going to use something I haven't used in a while. And it is the Cheek Stars palette. And this is a great palette. It's a great face palette. And it is from Benefit. It's got the great cookie highlighter. It's got Hula bronzer. It's got the Georgia peach. I didn't think I had that in here, but the Georgia peach blush, the Dallas blush, and the sugar bomb. So we're going to use the Hula the hula brush blush no not hula brush brush with hula and bronze and it is a fantastic color bronzing for especially fair people like me maybe medium people too it's not like enough to really contour but it just gives a little definition and warms up the face. And then I'm going to use Sugar Bomb Blush. Oh, look at that. It's a beautiful glow. That looks great. So the cheek stars, and it's great. And there's other face palettes by Benefit that are just as good. That's just the one that I happen to have and love dearly. So let's get on to the eyes. The eyes have it. And there's not a great neutral color. That's one of the bad things about monochromatic palettes is you have to start with something a little darker than I normally would like to start with but I'm going to go into let's see rebloom here and just pat it on a little bit onto this Sonia G brush no it's a Scott Barnes brush I'm just gonna go in real light with it So I can blend it out. So what have you guys been up to? I have been shopping for Christmas 
and Rome's birthday. Rome's birthday is Halloween. And the things that I've bought for him, he's ended up needing ahead of time. So he's already gotten like a pair of jeans that I bought him and a t-shirt. And so I have to keep purchasing things for him. So he can have a nice birthday. And he doesn't want much, but I love to give stuff. And I'm going to be doing a Halloween giveaway soon. Which will be a lot of fun. And that looks like a great way to start this look with this Blend that up some more. Let me tuck that back here. So it's in the way. And it just blends out so nicely. And that's a great way to set it up for a beautiful orchid eye look. So, we don't get trick-or-treaters. You guys get trick-or-treaters? We do not. We're in an apartment building on the end of a fancy street. And the, the driveways are mostly all straight uphill. So, we don't get a lot of trick-or-treaters here. And plus, it's not the kind of apartment building that you go, Oh, look, it's a cute little apartment complex. It's not like that. It looks more like a house. But let's go into, oh my God, this beautiful shimmer. Oh, that is beautiful. Can you see that shine? It is gorgeous. It's very similar to the color that I just blended out, but it's fine because we're doing a monochromatic look. That's pretty, 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 I say pretty. And now we're going to go into A little beautiful bright brighter purple color and just putting it kind of in the center there on the edge and in the center to give it a little dimension. And speaking of dimension, we're also going to go into a dark color to give it some depth on the outside corner. And I think I'm going to go into Ada, this deep blackberry color. Maybe a little bit more. really mixing with those shimmers and it's very very pretty it's blending out great and that looks really good and it looks pretty even I think which is unusual for me I'm gonna there's a light lavender color and it's called pretty one I'm gonna get my finger deep into it And blend it in from the inside corner. Wow, that's pretty. Let's see if I can get a little more over here. That looks fantastic. And I'm really happy with this look. 
So now I'm going to do some liner and mascara and I'll be right back. And voila, we have mascara and eyeliner and it really has pulled the look together and I'm loving it. And for my lips, I'm going to use Super Matte Stay Ink from Maybelline in number 15, a lover. Would you like to be my lover? My lover boy? My lover? <laughs> I'm a goofball. And there we go. We have a gorgeous look with the new ColourPop Orchid Do Not palette. I hope you have a great day or day of your choice and we'll see you real soon.